वेलकम टू और केमिस्ट्री फॉर एवरी वन द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन द ऑर्बिटल ऑफ एन एटम इज कॉल्ड इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फिग्रेशन टू राइट इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फिग्रेशन वी शुड नो दैट अटोमिक नंबर नाइट्रोजन अटोमिक नंबर इज सेवन सिंस नाइट्रोजन इज ए न्यूट्रल एटम अटोमिक नंबर इज इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स एक्चुअली इलेक्ट्रॉनिक कॉन्फिग्रेशन कैन बी रिटर्न इन थ्री वेज एस पी डी एफ नोटेशन then the second one is orbital diagram then the third one is condensed configuration in spdf notation the electrons are represented as a superscript for example you see s orbital two electrons can occupy so s2 in p maximum number of electrons 6 in d maximum number of electrons 10 here is that order of filling orbitals After filling 1s orbital, then only we can fill the 2s orbital, then 2p, then 3s, then 3p, then 4s. Number of electrons 7. So we can write 1s, 1s2. Then after that 2s2. Even though maximum number of electrons in p orbital is 6, but in nitrogen it can take only 3 electrons because number of electrons in nitrogen is 7. now we will write that orbital diagram In orbital diagram orbital is represented as a box so for one s orbital there are two electrons we are representing by arrow in 2s2 orbital two electron so one positive spin another one negative spin in 2p orbital only three electrons so 1 2 3 this is the orbital diagram for nitrogen now we can see that condensed configuration here we use that noble gas to simplify the electronic configuration for example see that nitrogen nitrogen is in the second period 2s2 2p3 now we can use that noble gas which is in the first period if you see that in the periodic table the noble gas which is in the first period is helium so we are writing helium here when you are writing we are writing inside the bracket helium the remaining 2s2 2p3 we are writing as such only this electron that means 1s2 two electrons are called core electrons and the remaining electrons 2s2 2p3 these are called valence electrons thanks for watching